In the previous two videos, we learned about linting and formatting our code base. In this video, let's learn how to prevent linting and formatting errors from being committed to our repository. When building applications, especially in a team, it is common to overlook a linting error or not format the code before committing the changes. This especially becomes an issue if you pull their changes and you see a lot of changes in the file when all you did was run a simple formatting command. So to ensure all files committed to git don't have any linting or formatting errors, we can use a package called lint staged in combination with another package called husky. Let's get started. For step one, we install the two packages as a dev dependency. So yarn add dash d husky at version four and lint staged. For step two, we define the lint staged tool configuration. It's basically a list of tasks that need to be run on staged files. Open package.json and over here, let me copy paste the configuration, which you can again find on my GitHub repo. So right after dev dependencies, I'm going to add the lint staged configuration. Let me go over this piece of code. We are basically telling that for every JS, JSX, TS, TSX, and JSON files present within the source folder, run ESLint and fix whatever errors can be fixed. Similarly, for all the above files and CSS, SCSS, markdown files including, run the prettier command and format the files. So that is step two, specifying the lint staged configuration. For step three, we add the husky configuration asking lint staged to be run just before the user commits their changes. So again, in package.json husky, this is an object, hooks, and on the pre-commit hook, we're going to run lint staged. Now we can test if this works as expected. In amp.tsx, let's violate the prettier configuration. We have set single quote to true, which means double quotes are flagged as an error when declaring variables. So I'm going to open user settings uncheck format on save and then in the app component add const name is equal to vishwas in double quotes let's first commit the package json and now if you stage app.tsx and try to commit this file you can see that husky throws a pre-commit error. If we take a look at the git logs, we see the eslint error. Error, name is assigned a value but never used. So husky aborts the commit, thereby preventing you from making a commit with linting errors. But what is also great about this is if there are no linting errors and if it is just formatting errors, then the code will be automatically formatted and then committed. So let's make a small change. Let's include name as part of the JSX. So now we don't have an ESLint error, but we do have a formatting error from Prettier. The ask is to replace double quotes with single quotes. But let's say I could care less for what the formatting is. And I try to commit this file. You can see that double quotes was automatically converted into single quotes and the file was then committed. So there is no way for anyone working in this project to unintentionally commit unformatted code. As you can see, adding this pre-commit hook for linting and formatting is definitely beneficial if you're working in a team. If your team doesn't make use of it, I highly recommend you introduce Husky and LintStage to your teammates. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video.